was fun. Or that might have been fun. Ha <laughs> ha! I actually don't think it was. Are we live? Uh, I think we're live. Dude, we're not live on here. No, I think we are, uh, I think we're live. Well, my Let's screen... get to the right page. Oh, they changed the whole format of this. Okay, there we go. All right, I think we're live. We are. Yep, o a wannabe Fujuki Chan is here. Daniel Lopez, hello everyone. It's Dylan from Yu Gi Oh! Everything. And uh, it's been a while since I've opened a pack, since I've given away a booster box. The box we will be opening and giving away. Join the giveaway Legendary Duelists, Immortal Destiny, uh, the villains of Yu Gi Oh! It's awesome. How are you guys doing? Uh, the Jared Punch stuff. I'm joined by my boy Cal, by the way. I'm all over the place. How's it going, The everybody? Jared Punch. I'm trying to shout out everyone who comes early. Nat Fee. Goyen, apologize for the butchering. Luz Victoria, <laughs> Tara Arnold, It's Flaming Foxy, Rob McLinn, Awanabe from Jiki Chan, that's a double shout out. Sabino <laughs> Menendez, Matt Long, NWP Dark, Ghostov, Dumon the Barian, Davaris Jones, Guillermo, Guillermo Sierra, Sueller, Brian Rice, Waylon Sawyer. Uh, I feel like the I feel like these names get harder and harder every yeah, time it I happens. Think I think it's great. Uh, I love it. I love it. everything. I love it. Uh, yeah, but Cal is here. We're What's gonna up, hang man? out with you guys. Um, it's been a while. Yes, and of course my brother decides to make a shake, and I don't know if you can hear the blender in the background. <laughs> you probably can. We're using uh, the Blue Yeti, which is a very sensitive mic, so you can probably hear everything going on. It's just on. the uh, hornets and wasps in the ceiling, actually. <laughs> <laughs> Pika226, Jarek, how you doing, man? Passion Fruit, Jarek Brewer's channel. What's up, Jarek? I'll uh, be on the lookout for that October 14th. And let's go. The Cursed Necrofear. Yeah, I think that goes for about 30, Sabino. Uh, I know Bane, Elemental Hero, Malicious Bane, is like 80 right now. So there are some valuable cards in the set. Oh, we yeah. will see oh, yeah. uh, what we can pull. Spam that cow emoji. You see that yeah. Nick T emoji. That's a new one. Love it, Ghost Nation. Uh, I will also be doing the giveaways for Rising Rampage. And for Speed Duel Scars of Battle, I have not pulled the winners of those. So if you enter those giveaways, then maybe you'll be uh, winning some boxes after this stream. But uh, much love, guys. We're going to get right to it. Doing good, Jafar. Doing good. Uh, Q4D Life Productions. Doing good, man. Thanks for coming by. Uh, let's switch scenes here. Oh, switching scenes. All right. Now we are. I just want to make sure the chat box actually works. I'm supposed to have a chat box right here. And as you can see, nothing is coming up, so that kind of looks all... Is it coming up on your screen? Uh, it hasn't switched yet. It hasn't switched yet. Let me look. Hmm. It should show. I'll let you know if it comes up or not. I don't see anything. Yeah, I don't either. All right, let me... Uh, day's been going well. Okay, some technical difficulties, but that's okay. Yeah, we'll work okay. around it. Yeah. Enjoy my big, uh, my big arm right here. <laughs> What's going on? Just gonna remove it and add another one. Yeah, I mean, I got new glasses. These are actually blue light glasses, so it helps with uh, staring at computer screens all day because that's all I ever do <laughs> with my job. So it helps take the strain off my eyes. Oh, you got new glasses, dude? You've been with me for hours. <laughs> <laughs> I genuinely did not notice. There we go. There we go. That is a big text box. All right, it's working. Yeah, looks good now. It's unfortunate the uh, emojis don't work. Yeah, yeah, the emotes don't come That's up. That's all right. That's all right. What are you going to do? Okay, there we go. We got our text box. Um, oh, yeah, Ghost Nation, I know. I've seen. Odd Eyes Vaughn, how you doing? Thanks for coming by. Matt Long. Yeah, I love the Matt. Uh, the final talking you go into the Vrain stream. We have a date. Yeah. It's going to be... Tuesday, October 8th, is it? Well, what's today? The 5th? The 5th. Yeah, the 8th. The 8th, probably around 8 p.m. Eastern time. That will be the final Into the Range podcast. All of us, Legendary Duels, it's going to be a blast. Let's get to opening. And remember, remember, uh, you will have the opportunity to win a booster box of this. Just enter in the description. Free giveaway, guys. It's the least I can do for all the love that you consistently show me. So when I win the giveaway, will everyone think it's rigged? When, when, yeah, honestly, <laughs> I know a lot of my friends do join the giveaways, and so far none of them have won. Uh, but when that happens, it'll be like, oh, it's rigged. But um, Seto Kaiba did give me money for this. You're right. <laughs> hey, Jack, thank you. Hello, and how are you? I, you know, where's that knife? I'm horrible at opening these. Give me it. Well, don't ruin it. 
How am I going to ruin it? You might squish the box in. I want to keep the box as a, um, a collector's you item. You notice I'm not bashing the box at all, and it's already open. All right, you're right. Yeah, I do love old school Yu-Gi-Oh. I do love how uh, Yami Bakura is in that. Elizabeth Games, how you doing? All right, there is our uh, our box. Let's get to it. I love, I mean, Dark Necrofear, one of my favorite monsters. That's the guy version of it. Absolutely gorgeous. Let's see if I can open this correctly. Vitri said, poor Calibro is at the smallest corner of the thumbnail. <laughs> yeah. Peering in on the, on the corner. There we go. I opened it pretty well. Uh, it's honestly a really, really beautiful box. Um, I like the packs. Not a pack opening channel. It is a pack opening channel. It is today. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it is today. I don't open them too often, but whenever I do it, come on, I'm always doing a giveaway. I'm always giving away a box. Oh, of course. It's going to look a lot better once I uh, actually get it. Let's see. So again, the big one in this set is Bane. Bane is the one that's going for, I think, like 80 bucks. So we'll see. Yeah, let's, we're shooting for Bane like Batman, you know? Did the donation money help you get all those artworks? Well, no, that was the uh, the Hilton money. The donation <laughs> money, that has helped me quite a bit. I'm very, uh, very thankful for that. Oh, yeah. Generous. Great people out here. Yep. All right, let's go. So our first evil hero. So I'm not sure all the archetypes that are being used in this set, uh, but we, you know, we'll see what happens. Dark Necrofear, one of my favorites. Uh, great duel, one of my favorite duels. Again, getting this to actually render in good quality is always one of the hardest things to do. For sure. I don't get this, man. This is supposed to be an HD webcam, and yet the quality is terrible. Maybe, maybe move it up a little. There we go. Yep. Call of the Earthbound. Ooh, that's an awesome one. Earthbound Greater Linewalker. It's a cool monster there. Oh, an Earthbound Immortal Kakapakapu. Uh, it's Kidu's... Yeah. What? <laughs> yeah. Uh, if you watch 5Ds, you'll get it. It's Kidu's monster. Um, <laughs> <laughs> That's a hell of a I, know, I, name. I just said it so like yeah. casually. Yeah, it is a hell of a name. That is a classic monster. Um, and again, what I love... See, it's Flaming Foxy. Thanks for coming by. What I love about the Legendary Duelist set is it is somewhat related to uh, the actual anime. So that's cool. So a lot of these monsters I am going to know. Uh, did Goose come by? I always see the uh, the goose emojis. <laughs> Bloody hell, it's Caliber. It is Caliber. What's it's up, Red Eye? <laughs> uh, Puppet Parade, of course. Quattro's gimmick puppets. Zoma the Spirit, a great trap monster. Another Preta Plant. I mean, you can't pay me enough money in the world to try and pronounce that. You want to give it a shot? Let me sit here. Let me hold it. Preta Plant Chlamydia. <laughs> <laughs> Preta Plant Chlamydia Sundew. Preta Plant Chlamydia Sundew. The Chlamydo Sundew. <laughs> <laughs> and a a pre <laughs> and a pre a pre fusion. Oh god, it's gonna be a long stream. Oh god, jeez, I love the caliber of Nick T emotes. Dude. Yeah, dude. That Nick T emote was the How old thing. is that Nick T emote? Whew. That Nick T emote is old. I had to do some digging there. Dark fusion. That is a cool looking mod. Of course, you see um, Elemental Hero Flame Wingman. In the background there. Moon Dragon Quia, one of the Rex Godwins like uh, that. monsters. That's yeah, that's cool really sick. Earthbound Immortal Rock Rurak Earthbound Immortal Raska. I can never pronounce that W name. Wirakacha I I Let me say. Let I'm me trying say to because I'm I can envision the characters say it. Wirakoka? Where I know I can envision Rex Godwin like say this monster, but I, I just can't actually pronounce it. Where Evil Hero Infernal Gainer. <laughs> And again, the gimmick puppet's one of the creepiest uh, archetypes oh in Yu-Gi-Oh. Yeah, at least from an anime. That's kind of cool, though. I yeah, like no, the the character that used gimmick puppets in Zexel, one of my favorite characters in that show. Really awesome character. And as we know in the Japanese version, him and Akiba Reiji shared the same voice actor. Caliber Road to uh, butchering names since ever. Yeah, Axe the Road. Thanks for coming by. How you doing? Road to a hundred is the filler arc. <laughs> <laughs> Got oh, dark man. calling. Oracle of the Sun, I believe that's another Godwin monster. Gimmick Puppet, Humpty Dumpty. Oh my god. Junk Puppet. Creepy. Puppets are just creepy. Ultimate Earthbound Immortal. That's a cool looking trap card. Yeah, I don't know if I've ever Is that supposed to be the that's supposed to be Roscoe, right? I don't know if you're asking me. No, I'm, I'm just, I'm just kinda question. asking myself, honestly. <laughs> One, two, three, I don't know what else to think of. Hey, how you doing? Thanks for coming by. <laughs> Earthbound Dill Pickle. Week we ran Kotaho Rasuka. Oh, we ran Kotaho Rasuka. <sighs> Danger Charizard. I yeah. I uh, I can't I can't pronounce it. I'm sorry. Which one? He's trying to spell it out, but I oh, can't pronounce it. Oh. Katie Ritter, thank you so much 
for the donation, Katie. I really do appreciate it. Hey, Dill, on Discord, I'm John C. Yes, wanted to let you know. Still waiting to hear for Blame Lightning shirt design and Garbaggio. Got more ideas like Goose. I will, I will message you back on Discord right after this. Um, thank you so much, Katie, for the donation. means a lot. And thank you for the artwork as well. Um, I will definitely message you back right when this ends over on my Discord. Awesome. So, yeah, I'm looking forward to that. Predator Plant, Drago Stapelia. I know I butchered that. I, I think I've actually... I think I've actually said more incorrect names than correct names. You're doing pretty cards. good, I think. Supe. Well, yeah, you think you don't know how they're pronounced either. Sentence of Doom. That's the card I said you're going to get six of them. This is one of my favorite cards. I actually didn't know what they named it in the OCG or I in the TCG. Like look at the Ouija board. Yeah, so it's Dark Necrofear, and it's the Ouija board that um, is used for... Um, not not Death Board. I can't think of the name of it. But whatever the, the death sentence, the final or death... Well, I can't think of the name of it. Anyway, it has a lot to do with the Yugi versus Bakura duel in Battle City. Awesome card right there. Okay. And then Evil Mind. Cool looking card there. Honestly, I love the artwork on these cards. They're all like sick. Yeah, I like it a lot too. I like it a lot Especially too. Especially for stuff like I haven't seen, so like all of it to me is like new. No, no, Yu-Gi-Oh! artwork is cool. really beautiful, yeah. man. It really is beautiful. I mean, you have over like nine, ten thousand cards, so like... And a lot of them are unique. Like, they're that, like, that's exactly what it is. And so you're going to like at least a few of them. Moon Dragon Quia. I imagine the Sun Dragon is in this as well. Another Dark Necrofear. Predator Plant. Drosso Phylum Hydra. Nice. Evil Hero Sinister Necron. That is a uh, really cool looking card that's there. Nice card. Uh, and there it is. Starving Venom Fusion Dragon. The Ace of Yuri. The Ace of... I mean, one of the best villains in Arc 5 until he wasn't. His redemption was a... Uh, a little quick, but still an awesome card. That's one of, I think, the first Dimension Dragons that I'm going to own, so didn't even realize it was in this set. A lot of times I don't even look at what's in this set I just opened. So, uh, yeah, that's really cool. We had a couple of hashtag rip cows in the chat. Why rip cows? <laughs> Cal is overrated. I'm overrated. No, that's Ghost Nation. Oh, Ghost. All right. I, you might think he's overrated. The cheerleaders in 2011 did not. Let me just say that. And he said Nick T is underrated. I'll agree with that. I'll agree with that, too. So I just was speaking <laughs> about the Sun Dragon. There it is. Sun Dragon Inti. So we have the Moon Dragon and the Sun Dragon. Earthbound Immortal. Revival. Doom Caliber Knight. Evil Hero, Infernal Prodigy, and another Evil Mind. Very cool. So we have this, we have, I feel like we have all of Rex Godwin's cards. Make a Rex deck. Make a Rex deck, yeah. Okay. We'll do that. Yeah, I know, I need to get merch. Mer merch is the big goal for 2020. I reached out to Carrie, by the way, our friend Carrie, even though you know her way better than I do. Yeah, sure. She's working on a revolver design. Really? That I'm commissioning, yeah, so. Awesome. I'm excited to see that because I love her style. Another Predaman, another Preda Plant Chlamydia Sundew, Dark Calling. Ooh, that's a cool looking card. As a Scatter Dawnwalker. What set is this? Like, what archetype is this? Synchro. I don't even know what archetype that is. Is that Godwin? Another Earthbound Immortal Kakapakapu. Giwan Tang. Thank you so much, my friend, for the five euros pounds. Wanted this set. Saw Evil Hero Malicious Bane was super hard to get. Really wanted an Evil Hero deck. Yeah, Evil Hero Malicious Bane is going for 80 right now, so I guess that shows you how tough it is to get. And another Evil Hero, Evil Hero Adusted Gold, is going for 67. So, of course, people want to play Evil Hero as well. Two good yeah. cards you literally need to shell out if you want three copies of each. Bucks. Yeah, if you want three copies well, of three, each, that's, yeah. it's insane. So, um, that's what the... You know, that's I have a question doing. for you while you're opening this. Sure, of course. Uh, two people have mentioned... That something about a yeah, donation, she, yeah, that includes me or something. He said, "Did you tell Cal about the ninety dollar dono?" And then did you tell Cal of Gladiator's donation? Gladiator, do yeah. This was in the stream that you want to watch, the table stream. Okay. Gladiator, freaking amazing guy, donated ninety dollars. Incredible awesome. donation. Amazing, amazing. And literally said, "This is for, this is a dollar for every woman Caliber has been with." <laughs> <laughs> I was dying. I was oh on the floor. Oh, my God. I was on the floor in tears. Nick T, we don't know. Didn't Nick T hit you up? He did. Tell the story about Nick T tonight. All right, all right. So we've got gonna, a good look into Nick T. I'm going to give you guys a story while Dylan's showing you all these cool cards, and he'll stop us if he finds a really cool one. So Nick T calls me up. I'm getting a haircut. I don't know if anybody noticed. You know, got the fresh haircut going on. It's good. And <laughs> thank you. And Oof, that's a creepy he thing. calls me. He was like, oh, like let's go out, you know, grab some apps and hang out. And I was like, oh, okay, yeah. That sounds good. I'm actually going to grab dinner with Dylan. 
So if you want to just hit him up and let him know, maybe we'll switch it and we'll do apps and a drink and I'll hang out. He goes, oh, it's a great idea. Yeah, I'll definitely let him know. And uh, Dylan, did did Nick T ever hit you up? Nick T never hit me up. Um, and Nick T was texting me earlier today. So it's not like we weren't in communication, but he never asked me to hang out. Yeah, so I think so, he just didn't want to hang out with you. Yeah, well, he said Jordan was there. That's probably what it was. Yeah, yeah. They didn't want to see yeah. us. They didn't want to see you. And that's how it goes sometimes, guys. But that's okay. <laughs> Uh, Dragon <laughs> Fist, how you doing? Lup, Jared Punch, Sam, Mad Kaiser, Malstorm, Win. Thank you guys all for coming by. Cyber Quasar. Well, we just answered your question, Quasar. So far, nothing crazy. Oh, there's our first XZs. Again, the gimmick puppet archetype just looks so cool. Number 40 gimmick puppet of strings. Another Sun Dragon Inti and a Perform puppet. You have the Boss Monsters gimmick puppet grinder. I'm not sure if grinder is in this set, but mm -hmm. that is a, um... Cal, were you asleep during the drunk Mario party? He didn't get to that part of the podcast yet. I wasn't asleep until the end. <laughs> well, yeah, but you were, but you were I faking was asleep. Asleep, right? Exactly. You, so you admit that you faked it. Yeah. Oh, I told you that. No, you didn't. Yeah. Oh, stop. Remember, I said I I woke up on the couch and I was like, oh, what happened? And I started laughing. Yeah, I remember that. Yeah. Well, oh, I geez. was asleep, and then I woke up, saw what was going on, and pretended to still be asleep. You're That's an, more of what it was. You're an asshole. Uh, there it is. The a card that I really, really wanted. Um, I, I just did a top ten field spells video, and this was the um, the number one for me. Oh, field awesome. spell videos in the anime. And what this did to the field in Duel Monsters, absolutely incredible. Such a creepy card. I think the artwork is actually a little censored. I think in the OCG, there's one where the, an eye is actually inside an open mouth. Which I think is censored. At least that's yeah. at least it was censored in the anime that way. I'm yeah. not sure if it's on the OCG card artwork, but really happy I got that card. Um, that was a card that I really, really wanted to pull. Really excited for that. Love Dark Sanctuary, man. One of my favorite cards. Need a little drink there. A little drink. Odd Eyes Vaughn, Devin. Thank you so much for the donation, man. Can we get a shout out for Crescendo? Yes, Crescendo actually, maybe Patrick Lee too, actually supported me on Patreon for a bit. I think Crescendo might still, or she did for a while, but yeah, they are awesome. Um, I'm familiar with both of their works, and yeah, definitely check them out. Crescendo, Patrick Lee, they do, as, as Vaughn mentioned, piano covers. Definitely good shout out there, Devin. Uh, great people in the community. Great, great people in the community. They do piano covers of the brain songs? Yeah, That's of Yu-Gi-Oh! Awesome. openings. Zoltan, yeah, I'm surprised that there was an ad because I don't even think I have ads on the live streams. I don't think I, I monetize them. That's just YouTube trying to take any any money they can. I think, I think when you join a stream, regardless, There's always an ad. you just start ad. No matter... That's, I guess, what it no is. No matter what, yeah. yeah. Nicholas Horton. Uh, there's another evil hero, uh, evil hero card. Another Kakapakapu. We have three of them. Well, now you can put them in your deck. You got to shake those pads. Does that work, Tam, my boy? Also, Tam, my boy, supporting that Tampa Bay Rays logo. I think they got a shot against Houston. Is that what that is, Tampa Bay Rays? Isn't it Tampa Bay Rays? Uh, maybe. Oh, no, no. You know what? It's probably Tam Boy. Yeah, it's not Tampa Tammy Bay. Tammy Boy. Tam, my boy. Tam, my boy. I, I'm just, I'm being an idiot. It does kind of look like there's like a ray in the background, though, so I can see it. Right? Malicious Fiend. Another Predoplast. Gimmick Puppet Bisque Doll. That's cool. That is, that's an ultra. That looks like, isn't bisque like a, um... A food? Yeah, bread. Like a bisque. Yeah, bisque. Yeah. Have you ever had French onion soup? I don't know why I transitioned to that. I, I've had I've had it once. I thought it was disgusting. Wait. Really weird coincidence, I guess. I was talking about French onion soup yesterday. Really? Yeah. And that's bizarre. They were talking, uh, the people I was with, one of them was at a bar and ordered French onion soup. They were, they were clearly intoxicated. Intoxicated, and went to the bar and sat in a crowded bar and were eating bar French onion soup. That is awesome. That oh is that awesome. Is cool. uh, this obviously, you know, one of the main monsters, the main representation of Yami Bakura in the final arc. That is, um, that is sick. I didn't That's even really realize this was in the set. Yeah, I see a lot of you guys. Uh, if I pull it, that'd be pretty incredible. I do not. Knowing my luck, I do not think I will be pulling Bane. Or any evil hero. Another gimmick puppet terror baby. I don't have... I, dual power was really good. 
Other than dual power, my luck on these live streams is horrible. But again, you can enter for a, uh, a free box, which I'm giving away of this set. Maybe Bane is in that box and I picked the wrong box. Uh, and if I pick the wrong box, then you can have Bane. Just free <laughs> giveaway. Join it you down below. You guys get Bane and... <laughs> I get nothing. And I'll be pulling the winners of Rising Rampage and uh, Scars of Battle after this opening. Sun Dragon Inti, another Immortal Revive. That's bizarre. That's w how, how often does that happen? This card was literally upside down. In all of the packs I've opened... That's crazy. In all of the packs I've opened, I've never seen that before. Maybe I don't a, know if that's uncommon. It probably maybe, isn't that uncommon. Maybe it's a sign for good things to come. That's weird, right? What card is it? You have to, you have to show Well, it's nothing mind. special. Call of the Earthbound. Supai, another evil mind. <laughs> that's funny, man. You see, uh... Dumont. Dumont. Dumont, each pack is around $5. Open this pack in my spirit. Okay, Dumont, thank you for the donation. In the heart of the cards. In the heart of the cards. Let's go. Give me that Bane. Give me that evil. Can get your focus back up. Can we, can we render in, please? Render. This is man. It's still got that back focus on the... I know. The, the, the box. Do I just... What do I do? What? What do I do? Ready? Right here. Bang. No, good. Oh, there we oh. go. Thank you. Wow, amazing. War of the Earthbound Immortal. That is a cool one. That is actually the first one that we uh, we got. Let's see. Final one. Another Kakapakapoo. Dude, we've gotten four Kakapakapoos. I have a new favorite card. <laughs> Kakapakapoo. It's fun to say. It's really fun to say. And it's a long name. Yeah, I know. It is a long name. But Dumont, thank you for the donation. Really do appreciate it, guys. Dreary Doll. Another Roar of the Earth. Now we're going to get 20 of these. Zoma. I think I've seen Zoma in every pack. Another Dark Sanctuary. If I get three of these, I'll be happy. Not that I'll ever use. So does it say the only way to use this is if... No, okay. I, I didn't know if Dark Necrofear actually had to be in the grave to use it in the real game. I don't think it does. Um, unlike the anime, obviously. Well, Takeru's yeah. dub name is Theodore. What do you think? Who's? Uh, Soulburner. Oh, Takeru, you said. Yeah. It's Theodore? Yeah. Are they going to call him Theodore, or are they going to call him Ted? I, I don't know. It's a good question. Maybe Teddy? <laughs> I could see him being a Teddy. Right? I could see him being a Teddy. Theodore. That's an interesting choice. I feel like that's almost too proper. Right? Yeah. It sounds very proper. Yeah, these Earthbound Immortals arc. I'm not, and they're not pronouncing the names well. I think we've gotten every single evil hero except the ones that, you know, cost an arm and a leg. That's a cool one. Yeah, the Predaplant cool. Another Predaplant Chlamydia Sundew. <laughs> another evil hero. Perform Puppet. Let me just keep going along. Yoshi. <laughs> Hashtag. <laughs> <laughs> Hashtag Yoshida is a friend. You might not even get that reference. Because you haven't been... You haven't I do. Up. Oh, you do? Yoshida is a friend was from a while ago. Yoshida is a friend. Really? I've yeah. been doing that that long. Oh, yeah. God. Surprised you guys don't get sick of my uh, corny jokes. Dark Spirit of Banishment. That is a cool looking card. I yeah, believe we is. have one of those already. Third Dark Sanctuary. Good. So go. I'm, I'm happy with that. Again, not that I'd ever play this deck, but it's cool. <laughs> Dragon Fist, Mark, thank you so much for the donation, my friend. I'm so sorry it took so long, three years, to complete my review series for Duel Monsters. Hey, work takes time, man. Don't don't apologize. Congrats on the 500 subs, man. GX next. Check out Dragon Fist 900. Does some really cool Yu-Gi-Oh! series reviews. That's awesome, man. Keep up the good work. Yeah, and thank awesome. you for the donation, Mark. I appreciate it. Congrats on 500. That's really cool. And hey, you know, videos... Don't don't put a time limit on them. Take as much time as you need. I didn't mention it before, but That's I really cool. yeah I really love the artwork here. It looks I don't know. It looks like it's like a I, I don't know even how to describe it. It reminds me a little bit of like Jack and Daxter when the metalheads attacked. I, I I know there's probably only two people that'll even understand that. <laughs> Remember when Dill couldn't could, couldn't pronounce mildly Japanese names? Yeah, Aoi. It took me about twenty five months. Yeah. I actually still think I'm saying her name wrong. <laughs> <laughs> I'm still saying it wrong. 
Uh, Darth Lemon, I actually agree. If they call him Theo, I think it would work, too. Right? For Theodore. Theo? Yeah, Theo would work. There you go. Humpty Dumpty. Well, I'm not even going to say it. Dark Spirits Mastery. That looks kind of cool. What is this even... Oh, it's most it's it's Necrofear. You can see either Necrofear or the other one. And a third starving venom. That's a cool artwork. I I just love how Necrofear looks. I feel like if I was ever gonna get a um a deck, mm -hmm. I would want to do a puppet deck. Really? Yeah. Oh that's a, yeah. They're so cool. Uh, the character that uses it in Zexel is awesome. Really creepy. Oh, that I believe is actually one of the rarer cards to get. Whoa, that's Predipla That is actually really cool. Predaplant, really Trifi Over Overitum. Trifi Overitum. And another Predaplanting. Uh, I think that's a pretty good card. Um, yeah, that's the fourth most valuable card in the set. Goes for about eight, nine bucks. So that's cool. Yeah, that's a cool one. That's awesome. I'll take that. Uh, put that over to the side. Cool Preda plant. I think I I think I missed a couple donations. I could always read it off if you want. Yeah, start with the Naoki and Soul one. All right, Naoki and Soul confirmed. Five dollars. Thank you. Said yo, big boy Dylan Cal. Great to finally make a stream. Need a new username after Naoki. Any ideas? Side note, Kakapayapu, <laughs> whatever that name Kaka is. Kakapu. Yeah, Kakapakapu is a god tier Yu-Gi-Oh monster name. I agree with that. Yeah, it is <laughs> Kakapakapu. Um, <laughs> I guess we're gonna have to wait for a new name, right? Yeah, I would just wait for a new name, Naoki. Thank you for the donation. We'll figure out, I think, pretty quickly into, or maybe in the um, who the Joe character is. Yeah, maybe in the buffer time though, we could we could think of a name. Yeah, yeah. For I would just time. I would wait till Yu Gi Oh Seven, mm -hmm. see who the joke is gonna be there. Wait, I, joke. I, I love that card. Joke. The comedic character. Joke. I respect him. Okay. I, I respect Naoki. Whatever you say. Five dollars from Duma on the Barian. Said, also, interesting fact, counting season zero, the last episode of Reigns was episode 999 of Yu-Gi-Oh! The first episode of YGO 7 will be the 1,000th episode. Yes, uh, Dumon, someone else had written that in a couple of streams ago. That's awesome. It is It is a really cool little fun fact, but it's, it's not really... It's not really going to be the 1,000th episode because, again, the... Um, can't think of my words. Toei, who did season zero, isn't associated with Studio Gallop, obviously. So Studio Gallop during arc five counted off like the 777th episode. And we really are basing it off of that. So really we're at like episode 970. It still is pretty insane though that when you include season zero, it's at 999. Exactly, yeah. Yeah. That's pretty wild. Yeah, it is pretty insane. What 007, how you doing, man? Also, $5 from Legendary Duels. Legendary Duels. He said, I'm late to the show, but I'm here now. Any good pulls yet? The uh, best pull was the Predator Plant that I showed before. None of the uh, evil heroes yet, but I will say this. Legendary Duels will be joining us for the um, Yu-Gi-Oh! Vrain's final talk in Yu-Gi-Oh! podcast. So that'll be exciting. Exciting to hear. Uh, excited to hear Legendary Duels thoughts. And that'll be fun. Again, that is Tuesday night. 8, 8.30 Eastern Standard Time. It will be all of us except Nick T. Oh, yeah, Nick T can't come. No. Nick T might be able to join us a little later on. Um, I mean, I'm not slamming a White Claw. I'm drinking a Monster. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see if I pull that evil hero. For, uh, first, I need this to render in. Dude, this is such... Do you need the magic touch again? I'll go over there and just move yeah, it Yeah, you do bit. it. You do it, dude. Angle and voila. It didn't work. Well, it worked the one time I did it. Come on, man. There you go. There we go. Sorry about that, guys. Another Diabound Colonel. That's such a cool card. An oh, geez. That is sick. Oh, can I try and pronounce this one? Yeah, go for it. Go for All it. Right, let me see the card. <laughs> Predaplant Helium Forhinkus. <laughs> Predaplant, Heliomorphic, yeah, I, God bless Yuri's voice actor, dude. God bless Yuri's voice actor. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Um, <laughs> love the pronunciation. How many packs do we have left? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Eleven packs left. Don't think we we're going to get what we uh, necessarily wanted. 
ridiculously expensive evil heroes, but that's okay. We got this, dude. Oh, Chlamydia Sundu. Chlamydia Sundu is back. Dark Calling. Revival. Oh! Oh, okay. Well, you know what? Again, these cards go for about eight each, I believe, so... Yeah, those, that's a nice card. Yeah. And the artwork's dope. Yeah, I'll take that. Yuri Blessed Us. The, uh, the Preta Plant... Yuri blessed us. I will uh, take that. That's really cool. So we got two of those, and this is a really cool one. Whoa. Supreme King's Castle. Obviously, that is a reference to Jaden Yuki in Season 3 of GX. That's is that the bridge that he dueled? Um, oh, it's the castle that he dueled. Yeah, that's that's a really cool card. Jeez. Shadow Realm said, I was doing curls for the girls. I was going to give up. Then I remembered I wasn't doing them for the girls or myself. But for Cal Senpai. <laughs> Keep getting those curls in, baby. And no. Red Eye, I give everyone the magic touch. Naoki is Wink. soul confirmed. Dylan, I'm disappointed. How could you call Naoki a joke? He was undefeated all the way through episode 60. <laughs> How many other duelists did that in frames? Well, One. Playmaker, Soul Burner. Okay. Uh, yeah, maybe that's it. Oh, yeah, that's so he's top three. Yeah, he's a top three duelist. He's a top, well, Lightning. I mean, they never dueled, though. No, Naoki was great. And thank you for the donation, Naoki. You're amazing. <laughs> Ooh, that's a cool fusion card. That is a cool fusion. Yeah, I mean, Preta Plants. I mean, I, I'm going to have to take a look at Preta Plants, dude. This, this, uh, just for the names? Just for the names? Yeah, Preta Plant Chlamydia. I really <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> that's what it says, dude. It's crazy. Gimmick Puppet Des Troy. That's gross. Dude, the Gimmick Puppet cards are so cool. No, dude, they are. Called the Earthbound... Another supreme, another supreme king's castle. Maybe you know what? Maybe I have to open the pack and give you the cards. No, you do it. See this? Put Join the, the giveaway. Giveaway in the description. Yes. Join the giveaway. Get Bane for yourself. Oh, Barrett, let us here. Oh God. What sports did Dylan play as a boy? That's a strangely worded question, isn't it? <laughs> you ready for this? Yeah. <laughs> Cal Caliber's opening it. We'll see. Maybe he's uh. You definitely had more luck with the women in high school. Go. All right. I don't know if this correlates. Let's see. Yeah, we'll see if it correlates to Yu-Gi-Oh cards. Oh, that's a cool gimmick puppet, though. You're going to have all the gimmick puppets you want. It's funny that the one you opened had, like, four oh, gimmick puppet cards. Yeah. <laughs> Barrett, how you doing, though? Thanks for coming by. Nicholas Horton, thank you for the donation. New York City Comic Con would have been the perfect place for Konami to announce the U.S. premiere of the Vrains dub. Absolutely. Um, I agree. That would have been smart. I don't know when the Vrains dub is coming. I actually feel like it's not even going to come. Anime, at least in the United States. Anime Chan Gaming, how you doing? Thanks for coming by. But, um, we'll see. Yeah. Vrains dub, man. It's it's a shame. I really wanted to check it out. Wait, but. so, so Dill, did you see Barrett's question? Yeah, I played tennis. Is that the only sport you played? I bowled a little bit. Occasionally. I was going to say, you were a good bowler. I, 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 I could bowl in the We were in actually the uh, doubles partners in tennis. We were doubles. That Fun was a fact. true story, yeah. Before we did this, we played tennis. <laughs> What's up, Pete? How you doing? Oh, Pete, how you doing, dude? Pete. Pete will be with us Tuesday night as well. Again, the only yes. one that won't be is Nick T. That'll probably be the next time we're live on this channel. I'm really excited for that. Me too. I haven't been on one of those streams yeah, in a little bit. Yeah, it's the final one. Come on, can we render in, please? There we go. There you go. Malicious Edge. That's We're running out of time. Ooh, Oracle of the Sun. Well, we only have five packs left. Well, if you could count, it's actually four. Four packs left <laughs> I can't count. It's not looking good. Annie McFarlane, how you doing? Neo Storm Maxton, how you doing? Thanks for coming by, guys. Ah, boy. Well, let's see. <laughs> last, <laughs> last chances here. Earthbound Geoglyph. I think that's our first one of those. That's cool. It's a really cool looking card. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Another freaking cockapockapoo. Oh, boy. That's funny. Let's see. Let's see. I'm running out of time. Puppet Parade. Yes, Barrett Letty is absolutely right. Obviously, my last video, if you haven't checked it out, is me going to that art show. Barrett Letty, dude, sends me a, a picture of him and Goose 
at the at the art show today no in New York City. Way, yeah, dude. he just sends me a picture and it's just goose. goose, and it's goose. I met him at Liberty City. Oh, really? Yeah, so like I know what he looks like, uh -huh. dude. That was oh man, I was so jealous. Would have loved to be there. I missed all the good. All the good people went like Friday, and all you know, all the well known people went Friday and Saturday. Completely missed all it. All the people you would have, you could have known. Yeah, like the voice <laughs> actors and stuff. Yeah. And then Goose is going, ooh. That's a cool looking card. Yeah, Supe Duskwalker. I guess that's also Godwin. Supe. I don't know what archetype that is. I don't know. I don't know, guys. I wish I was smarter. That's probably going to conclude it. I don't think we're getting a Bane. Uh, Naoki is so confirmed. Thanks for the donation. Lads, who was Ed and who was Deuce Returner? Basically, who was the main server? Who was the? I know what he means, but I don't know like and, like the advantage. And right, who, was who the served when it was advantage and who served when or who returned when it was deuce. I think um, it's a very fancy way to word that Naoki. I think it would just went on whoever's turn it was. Last like, card. I don't think there was a specific one. Uh, uh, it's cool artwork though. <laughs> no ban. <laughs> No Bane. Right. No Bane or um that other that Necrofear yeah. monster. Best pulls to uh Trifo Ovarian Overitum. However you say it. I'll take it. I'll take it. I mean even if I pulled like Bane, I wouldn't sell it. Yeah. I, yeah. I keep all these anyway. But uh I'll be honest. Spam that goose emote. Spam that goose emote goose. right now. Goose <laughs> How you doing, dude? Goose, I was just talking. I was just talking about him two minutes ago. He must have heard you. Maybe you did. Goose, I was just talking about you, dude. Rewind it a bit. <laughs> Rewind what? Goose. Oh, Sa Samantha Schwartz. That's my cousin from Staten Island who I haven't spoken to in years. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. I've, I've spoken to her somewhat recently. Sam, love you, cuz. Hope you've been good. And we've been, we've been doing good, Goose. We've been doing good. Yeah. Um... So that's the opening. Join the giveaway. Link in the description. Link in the description. You gotta... Join that giveaway. $5 donation from you. Oh, you. Thanks, man. I appreciate it. it. Big rip. Gotta donate to show my presence. Gotta sell my organs for evil heroes. Nick T... Boy... VC'd us? VC'd oh, Nick T VC'd us yesterday. Us yesterday. Where were you, Dill? I was asleep. I was asleep very early on. I woke up to the text. I apologize. I... I'm going to bed right after this. Are we you? were talking about it. Like we don't, we don't have lives anymore. It's a lot of work. This is, this is only the second time we've seen each other in probably like two months. Yeah, three months. Yeah, we and it was like, just uh, literally grabbing food and that was it. Yeah, yeah, it sucks, man. I've been busy. You've been busy. Yeah, it sucks. But night doing all the late stuff is always tough for me. Yeah, I have to get up so early. Detective Dulista, how you doing? Okay, we are gonna switch over now. Things are, <coughs> things are gonna get trippy, man. They're getting trippy, man. Okay. What'd you do? We are pulling the winner of Scars of Battle, Ooh. and the winner of Rising Rampage. I want to see how this looks because I never get a chance to actually see how this looks. Okay. Um, so Caliber obviously has his laptop up, so I'm just yeah, gonna check it. it out. I know there's a bit of a delay, so by the time you're watching this, um. Jesus Whoa. Christ. That is trippy. Oh, are we? Am I? I guess I'm still on screen? Yeah. Well, the screen, hold on. There we go. Oh, you have to move yourself over in? Yeah, although I might be blocking who the winner is. Guys, yeah. technical difficulties. If you saw the table stream, this is what happens. These streams never run smoothly. Um, I just want to make sure that you guys will be able to. <laughs> Isn't that a good thing? I mean, Dylan hates Calibro. <laughs> Oh, that's so good. That's true. If he's not wrong. Wait, what? No, I just want to see if that's going to block the winner. Yeah. Well, good. Then you can move yourself. Yeah, I scrolled up. Okay. Okay. Yeah, we're picking the winner, guys. Drum roll. Drum roll, please. And the winner of the Rising Rampage box is... Juan Abad. Juan Abad, you are the winner of Rising Rampage. I'm not sure if you're currently... Uh, Watching the stream, but congratulations, Juan. Congratulations, Juan. You have won Rising Rampage. And let's see who's winning Speed Duel, Scars of Battle. Ooh. Let's take a look. This is exciting. I like this. Already 130 entries into that. I like that. All right. All right. Check another drum roll. 
Yep, another drum roll. Winner of Scars of Duel. Scars of Duel? Scars of Battle. Scars of Battle. And the winner is... Gustavo Medina. Why do I... Is that... That's Goosey Kill. Goose won! <laughs> Goose! Goose! Oh my god. He just hops into the stream and then he wins. That's insane. That's insane. Well, Goose, you won... Uh, <laughs> you won Scars of the Battle, my friend. Um, that's pretty funny. Usually, like... I, I've known the people in the past, yeah. but like I usually don't like recognize them right away because it's usually a real name. You have his IP address up there. Oh, well, that's fine. I mean, it's not actually the IP address. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's... Oh. Oh. Oh, we're back here. Well, that's awesome. So, Juan and Goose. Juan and Goose. There you go. You also got a $10 donation from Macalaxi. Oh, Matt, dude. Said, gotta get that dual monitor set up, my dude. He's not wrong. Yeah. He's not wrong. But unfortunately, I, said that. I don't know if that's coming. Um, <laughs> I, know, I know you guys say no fair, but I will say this. There are always chances to win on my channel. I have another really cool giveaway sponsored by people that work for Duel Links, I believe, coming out soon, so definitely be on the lookout for that. Uh, and again, every month I'm giving away something. Immortal Duelists. Win it. Join it. Win it. I'm going to uh, join free, it. Free, <laughs> doesn't matter where you live. Doesn't matter where you live. Uh, Matt, thank you so much for that big donation. Oh, man. That was fun. Oh, yeah. I mean, you didn't get the guy you wanted, but... No, I didn't get the top two guys, but you know what? I'm happy with it. It was fun. I got to hang out with the community. You got two bronze medals, though, technically. You got the third... No, I got the fourth. Oh, fourth? Oof. Does that, do they medal fourth? No, no. So I don't get anything. No. You actually... You stand right next to the stage where the people get the medals. All right. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Did Goose leave? I don't even see him comment. I don't know. He must I, have. I got really excited because I've never actually... I don't think anyone's ever won that's been in the chat before. Yes, yeah, so he got excited because he thought he was... Yeah, here. I'm like, I get to see a genuine reaction. Um, I will give away to other countries. Yes, Detective Dulista. When I run a giveaway sponsored by Konami, that's USA only. When I do my own giveaway, I'll pay extra money to ship it wherever in the world. I mean, all the love for the super chats that you guys show me, Patreon channel members, it's the least I can do. If I have to pay a little extra for shipping international, I'll do it. So yeah, it does not matter Goose where you live here, in the world. The Goose is here. Jack Rhodes, thank you for the donation. Slick table, bro. Um, yeah, this can fit comfortably like five, six people, I think. I think easily six people. So that's really cool. Um, and Goosey Q, I usually win when I'm not in stream. Well, hey, you won a box when you're in stream. So that's, that's awesome. really cool. I'll send this out to you soon. How do I sign up? You can sign up for the giveaway link in the description. All you have to do is enter your email address. That way I can contact you if you win and get your shipping information mm -hmm. or your shipping address. So please enter. I mean, this is a major way that I try to give back to you guys for the love and support. I'm even, I'm even entering. Yeah, enter, dude. I want to get it, yo. I mean, if then you win, I'm start, just going to pick start number building two. But... Oh, but I wanted the puppet, so this is my <laughs> chance to get the puppet. You, know? you can have every puppet I pulled. Well, well, if I don't win the box, we'll talk about okay, it. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Um, do you not like Arc 5 because you have no Arc 5 poster? No, I do have an Arc 5 poster right there. It's off screen. Yeah. I do have an Arc 5 poster, though. Um, yeah. I, I like Arc 5. But, yeah. I guess, you know, it sucks because, like, I'd love to keep talking and chatting, but, I mean, I feel like it's, it's probably time to say goodbye. Yeah, I mean, you know, I'm going to the Giants game tomorrow, so I have to be up bright and early. Bright and early, my friend. Watch my team lose, but... I feel that I'm a I'm a Mets fan. I'm a Jets fan. I'm a Mets fan too. It sucks. Um, but yeah, thank you. <laughs> I'm a Mets fan. I mean Jets. Well, Mets doesn't Jets. matter. Uh, thank you to everyone who came by. Uh, if, I, if those of you wondering late, the best pulls that I got were these true Preta plants. Mm -hmm. I think they go for like eight bucks and change each. Didn't get any of the top three, but that's okay. People in chat want you to do a Calibro giveaway. Like give away you? Yeah. Okay. I will say again the the giveaways that we'll be doing for the Jump Fest to stream. We're, we're, we're giving away, like, a couple of major prizes, some yeah. minor prizes. That's going to be a monster stream. So, like, I'm really excited for that. <laughs> you donated five. and goes, by the way, you need to put in your mom's credit card number and the three digits on the back to enter the giveaway. <laughs> <laughs> VC time. Well, you have to do that to save the Fortnite characters. Um, <laughs> it's amazing. All right, you. Thank you so much for the donation. Uh, thank you, everyone. Awesome. You're all great. Calibro, thank you for joining me, dude. Hey, man. Always a pleasure. I appreciate it. I love it. being here. I love being on, on the camera. Maybe for, dual Maybe for Dual Devastator, you can come back and join me. Hey, man. Whenever. Okay, if I'm cool. free, I'm there. I appreciate it. As Pete said, we'll give Callaway for free. Jar um, Dylan spit. Barrett Luddy is sick. <laughs> <laughs> it's the 
<laughs> Sick man. Well, did you hear about the the e girl that was giving away her bath water? Well, yes. So it's kind I'm of similar. I'm not an e girl. It's well, you're an e boy. No, but e girls can really do whatever they want. I'm just saying it, it's that's probably where the concept comes from. Anime Chan Gaming, I noticed you. Yeah. Although I would not consider myself a major YouTuber by any means, but I mean, if you do, then. You're, know, yeah. you're Next After Dark will maybe be Wednesday night, Thursday night. It's definitely going to be after the final talk in Vrain's one, and then we'll do After Darks more consistently. But until next time, guys, yeah. I love you all. Thank you so much for all the donations. You guys are the ones that make this possible, all these giveaways. Um, and thank you to just everyone who watches my videos, comments in the chat, comes and hangs out. means the world. Love all of you. Thank you all so much for watching, and I hope you have an, an amazing, amazing day. day. Thank you, guys. Thanks, everybody.